Peace and praise is just a little inspirational note to encourage, empower, and enlighten. If it touches you, offer a note of thanks. If it moves you, meditate on it. If it changes your life, please share with others. In honor of Black History Month, this post will include a reflection and integrate facts from the history of people of African descent around the world. I look to you. Know from whence you came. If you know whence you came, there are absolutely no limitations to where you can go. James Baldwin. During the winter months in places where cold weather converts the landscape into snow globes and freezers, many people choose to stay inside and bundled up. As fun as it can be in the beginning, eating soup, playing card games, and participating in winter activities, after a while it can become a little monotonous with restrictions of being able to only do a few things. Cabin fever can set in and dampen the mood. It's during these winters, whether the physical season or a downtime in an individual's life, that we often lose focus or start to doubt and question our reasons for staying on our particular course. How can we persevere, especially when the groundhog sees a shadow and the winter sentence is prolonged, testing our strength and will against the harsh times? The enslaved Africans in the United States who chose to convert to Christianity, there are those who retained their traditional religions in private, made parallels between their conditions and biblical stories. Their status as a slave and lower class member was reminiscent of the plight of the children of Israel while Harriet Tubman was considered Moses, leading the people to the promised land. The similarities in the situations gave some hope, and when in doubt, they would take solace in the outcome of the stories. What really comes from these winters is the ability to adapt and persevere. We become more malleable, flexible, and even more creative in our approach. Isaiah 40, 31 reads, But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. If considered as a time for refinement, we can be renewed and enriched so that when the next big summer arrives, we're more prepared than ever to showcase the skills we've acquired. Consider identifying your own personality traits, then seeking a biblical story or character that matches them. Go beyond the obvious. Ask God to direct you and do a little research. Over the coming weeks, study the person in the episodes as a source of enrichment on your own journey. This has been Amina McIntyre with Peace and Praise, February 5th, 2013. Peace and blessings. This has been Peace and Praise.